The wheel has chosen Breath of the Wild again. We did not do this shrine. We got to it, but we didn't do it. So let's do it to it. Hello, and welcome back. Let's do some good. And hopefully not some bad. Because if we do some bad, we might end up dead. The wind guides you. I think this is one that's supposed to teach you how to use your glider with wind. Whee! Amber? It's, mm, mm, nope, don't know her. Whee! <laughs> okay, that's a return path. This goes over there. There's still more treasure chests to get. Yeah, there's that treasure chest over there. Um, I think we're supposed to use this wind to get over to it. Mm, not like that. And that takes us back. We might be able to just make it from over there, but I'm not sure. Because we like um, almost immediately lose the speed once we get out of the wind vortex. I don't remember for this one. This is only like the, the first real shrine, and I'm already having problems. I cut, I cut that a little short, didn't I? Um, let's try just running at this very edge here. I feel like I jumped too, too early and pulled my shoot too late. Yep. Whee! Oops. I did it again. Try that better. Hmm. Having issues pulling the chute faster. Nope. Oh. Guess he was not paying attention to where he was going. He was too busy whistling. Get me. Hi. How's it going? <laughs> Gonna run out of hearts before we get anywhere near. Oh my god. Can you just stop? And just stop being bad? Uh, I did do some off-screen grinding, I guess. Uh, I have a bunch of wood. A lot. I also have some food that I found. I mostly just got wood. Okay. Let's get this chest. There we go. See, that wasn't hard. Just had to stop being an idiot. Damn it. Uh, that's a claymore. I would like to at least pick it up. That's a claymore. That's a knight's claymore. That's a traveler's claymore. This we can get rid of. Yay! In Tears of the Kingdom, you're able to go into your inventory without leaving the chest menu. Which is a very welcome feature. Over in this game, nope, that's not a case. Um, yeah, let's go back to the regular sword. And also you have to, like, actually remove the thing from the chest for the little icon to show up and say that you opened it and got it. Weird, but okay. Hi there! Mm hmm What's up, little man? Have this ball. It's good for you. I swear. May the goddess smile upon you. <laughs> What's with the laugh? Don't worry about it, kid. I'm worried. I'm kind of worried. I said don't. But I am. And you saying not to worry makes me worry more. I'm so scared. Anyway. Uh, I don't know if this is a good place to do it. Probably not. Sorry, Zelda. We'll do it later. Uh, maybe the bridge would be better. We'll be a good spot for it. Proxim Bridge. There's a dude over there. Let's get over there faster. After we talk to him, we can do the thing that I'm thinking of. If you talk to him... 
on this ledge. Wait a minute. Please, think about what you're doing. You won't change the world by jumping carelessly to your doom, don't you know? That would only do one thing, and that's... Trying to be batty. Seriously, think of the shock I'd suffer seeing something like that. Now calm down and jump off that rail. And don't jump down that way. Climb down this way. Mm, if there wasn't enemies over there, I'd just jump down. Man, don't ever do something like that again, got it? You almost gave me a heart attack. Seriously. We're doomed. I mean, don't panic. Sorry, who are you? Have we met? Well, it doesn't matter who you are, really. I was just getting tired of talking to myself. So you've come at a good time. By the way, those strange things that popped out of the ground, did you see them? I'm not talking about the mushrooms here. I'm talking about those towers. They seem to have popped up all over the place. That's not the only strange thing that happened. Those long deserted shrines slowly started glowing. You know what that means, don't you? The end is here! With all this craziness happening, I keep on. I've been keeping an eye on that thing. Just to see if it suddenly starts moving, you know? What thing? Talk about the ga Guardian, of course. Haven't you heard an old story about Hyrule? See that thing over there? The one shaped like an overturned urn? That is what I'm talking about. Did you know some of them can move? One of them once crashed, chased me down, and tried to kill me. This one here? No, it was a different one. That one was closer to the castle, but before the forest. The forest? When they spot you, they shoot blue beams of light at you. Man, I was so sure I was at the end for me. I was prepared for the worst, but I somehow managed to escape into the nearby woods. You think it was my lightning fast reflexes that saved me? Yeah, I wish that. Through this, I just got lucky. Anyway, and your guardians like that are still watering around the castle. Be careful. Okay. So, between streams, I did find my amiibo cards. And some of you might be like, amiibo cards? What are you talking about? Uh, amiibos cost a lot of money, and cards cost like 12 bucks for all of these. This is almost every single Zelda amiibo before Tears of the Kingdom came out. So. Um, that's the wrong button. Use amiibo, yep. That. So let's start with uh, Link Archery. And I think you can use one of each character per day. Nice. Mighty Carp. Some people might consider this cheating. I say I don't care. Chill with Finn. Trout. It's gonna make a lot of things easier. And you also want to grab everything before you scan another enemy build, because if you scan too many, they're gonna start uh, disappearing. That's a good bow. Um, all we have is fives. This one we've used, so get rid of that. That's a 14. Cool. And now let's get rid of this chest just so it's out of my way. You guys got anything good over there? Surprise! They didn't care. Okay. Um, next up is the Zelda Smash Amiibo. I don't have these in any, in any specific order, so they're just kind of sitting here. Electric Saflina. Amaranth. Cool Saflina. Warm Saflina. And I don't want the bow. Sorry, I just got a text. I will look at it momentarily, but we did, we got an opal from that one. Okay, next is the Book Hoblin from Breath of the Wild. That's this game. Lots of meat. You can't carry any more bows, but can I carry any more meat? Yes, yes I can. Spiked Boko Spear. Not very good, though. Inventory's full. Um, give me one second to look at this text. Uh, oh yeah. Just someone asking me if I like a certain kind of drink. And I do. Okay, so that that's not even worth getting out of that chest, so just yeet. There's a possibility that I'm hitting a fish down there each time I do that, and that's cool. Next is the Wind Waker amiibo for the 30th anniversary of Zelda. Armored Porgy. Uh, Staminoka Bass. Stealth Fin Trout. Ooh, Sea Breeze Boomerang. That might be, be cool to use. Um... 
what was it? 20 something, I think. Um, that's a broadsword, but it has critical hit. This is a normal sword. I think this is special because it was, uh, it's the one from Wind Waker. But, um, boomerangs are cool because you can throw them and they actually come back. And then you have to grab them, you have to catch them. Um, some enemies can actually grab them out of the midair, so. It's not always the best thing to use. Uh, okay, let me reply to this text one more time. Okay. Um, next is... This guy that we haven't met yet in this game. Rocks. Hmm. Durability up might be better than um, our sledgehammers. Let's get rid of this one because it's that one has long throw. Yay! See, that wasn't very long at all. I'm only gonna show getting all these amiibos this one time. I'll probably do a bunch of it off stream, but might as well show them all off now. Next up is Skyward Sword Link. I dropped the card. And also everything on this guy. Ice arrows, nice. Um, cool. A single rupee. Apple. Ooh, a purple rupee, nice. An apple and another single rupee. Okay. Um, get rid of the chest. Sir, if you would just leave, you wouldn't get hit by boxes. Next up is the orig original Link. Hi! A blue rupee? I thought I already had one of those. No, I got a red one. I guess I could just, um, not that. Hmm, boop. Yeah. Use that to break open these boxes, or these barrels. Where am I aiming? Right there. Okay. Getting a decent amount of money out of these. I haven't even opened the chest yet. Cool. Where did that card go? Oh, I see it. Another broadsword. With attack up six? Ooh. Um, what's my other broadsword at? 20? Eh. What is this one again? 15 plus 6? Oh no, it's 20. Hmm. That's better than this this one. Wait. It was a broadsword. So it is better than the one I had. Cool, thanks. Um, okay, there's just chests down there now. Okay. Next is... Sheik from Smash Bros. Zap Shroom. Kill Shroom. Highly Mushroom. Silent Shroom. Rush Rooms. Very nice. Ooh, Shield of the Mind's Eye. 16. Um, let's get rid of the one we're currently using. Nice. Yeah, I'll probably just do the rest of these amiibos off stream every once in a while. But for this first time, I'll show it off. Next up is the Guardian from this game. Maybe. There we go. Metal boxes. Gross. Just drop it on top of the other one. I probably could have gotten all three at once. Ancient Spring. Bunch of other goodies. Mm. That was almost bad. <laughs> I pulled it back as I let go, and I was like, wait a second. There we go. Ooh, a ruby. Those are good. Guardian shield. Nice. Let's get rid of this shield. 
Guardian shields are super good because uh, they deflect things without you having to try. Okay, next is uh, Zelda and the Loftwing from Skyward Sword. Maybe. Mm, there we go. That one didn't even give a chest. Sun's room. Okay. Next is this person from this game that we haven't met yet. I would name them off, but I don't want to spoil anything. Even though it's just names. Lots of food. What from the chest? Another broadsword. That one's only 14 with critical. Um, would be better than my axe. I do want to keep a torch. Eh, we have a lot of other big swords, so yeah, we can get rid of the axe. Yay! Just keep throwing things into the water. I'm gonna kill all the fishes! Also, I prefer one-handed weapons over two. They're not as strong, but they are uh, faster. And I prefer speed. Next up is... Link on a horse from Breath of the Wild. Maybe. Did one of those mushrooms just go off the edge? No, it didn't. It almost did, though. Another soldier's broadsword that we don't need right now. Okay. Nope. Nope. There you go. Yeet. I don't need that right now, so I'm not going to grab it. Uh, next is Ganondorf from Smash Bros. Yeah. I like how his name's Brigo, because he's near a bridge. Bridgeo. Hmm. If you got away from all my stuff, dude, you wouldn't be getting hit by flying chests. Mm. Get back over there. <laughs> I didn't do help very much at all. I don't know why I didn't go any higher for that one. Please? Please? Just go all the way up as high as we can. There we go. That was worth it. Purple, purple rupee out of that one. Uh, Moblin Guts. Ooh, my favorite. There we go. A single red rupee. Eh, better than nothing. Oh, I thought that was something I didn't pick up right there. Weird. Okay. Uh, next up is Link from the remake of... Link's Awakening. That's a fish. A hearty salmon. Uh, when that just lands on the fish and it does a little smack, it can actually kill it and it will despawn. Is that our first set of shock arrows? Yep. I think that's all the different kinds of arrows in this game now, besides, you know, that was, those ones. You know, th those spe special ones. Next is this other guy from this game that we don't know the name of yet. Lots of apples and a palm fruit. Some arrows. A swallow bow that has an 18. Um, probably a lot better than anything we have. Yep. With attack up nine? Damn. I will gladly take that and yeet that chest off the edge. Uh, next is Link of the Toon variety from the Smash Bros. Stop killing my fishes. Another broadsword with critical hit up. Next is Zelda from Breath of the Wild. 
Aye. A mighty thistle. And what else? A soldier shield at 16. Better than what I have, I think. Um, better than that one. Thank you. Next is another link from the Smash Bros. <gasps> That's actually a Pona. I will use that, just not now. When, when we leave. Next is uh, Twilight Princess Link. Okay. Next is uh, Young Link from the Smash Bros. Don't kill my fishes! I think they can despawn. Maybe it just kills the fish. Soldier's Claymore with 20. Uh, Claymore. Eh. We already have that, so. Uh, I could keep both of these horses, but that's going to A, be difficult, and B, not be really worth it. Um, still got a few left. Next is Majora's Mask Link that you can kind of see through. Oops. Lots of shrooms. A razor shroom, that's new. And an iron shroom. Another soldier's claymore. Uh, next is another character from this game that we have not met yet. That one. That character. Getting fish from this person makes makes a lot of sense. Soldier Spear, 7 with a critical hit. Not very good, though. Okay, next is another Link from Ocarina of Time. Another soldiers play more. Thanks. Then I believe we have one last one. Well, technically one last one. One last one before the really good one. This is Toon Zelda from The Wind Waker. Swift Carrot. That chest is upside down. Ooh, a Night Shield with 40? Holy shorts. Uh, yes, please. What has our lowest? You have durability up. You have durability up. Um. Hmm. We already have one of these, so we'll get rid of this one. Thank you, Toon Zelda. And this next one kind of is different. Um. Oops, sorry. So I did have the actual card at one point, but I also had the figure at one point as well. Um, this literally is just a black card that I have the tag on. Um, I had the Wolf, Link, and Minna combo amiibo, and I used it, the actual figure, when I 100%ed Twilight Princess. And in that game, if you use an amiibo card, you save a record of one of the trials in that game, and how many hearts you had at the end of that trial. I had all 20 hearts, but I didn't really want the figures anymore, so I kind of got... I kind of destroyed it, and then I was going to put it into the actual card of the Wolf Link card, which was just a picture, but that didn't really go so well, so it's just a black card. But, in this game, that's the wrong rune. In this game, if you use it, you get... Wolf Link as, an, as an, a companion. Yep. Okay. We're going to take one of these opponents to where we need to go. And yeah, he has all 20 hearts. From It, it literally takes how many hearts you had at the end of that game and puts it into this game. Um, let's do that for now. I also would like to... We just got a, a swift carrot, and I think if we give it to a horse... 
they'll actually go a little bit faster. Hey. Wolfling, stop it. Here you go, friend. Cool. So this isn't technically our horse yet, but um, we can make it our horse. That's what we're going to. And also we can we you can find other horses as well. What is this? Oh, that's it. Go? Yeah. Um. If we'll flink will follow you around as well. Also, I think if he dies, he's gone for the rest of the day. Or like IRL day. I don't know if you can heal him though. I'm sure you can. Yeah, he's gone. Is there still head? Oh, you're still here. You might be able to feed uh, Wolf Link and have him heal. I don't know. I got off the horse here because I wanted to do this. Oh, there's an arrow. Thank you. Wolf Link just literally helps you fight. So if, if we follow this flower... Um, and not get hit by the rock. I didn't, I, wanted, I didn't want Wolf Link to get hit as well. Maybe he leads you to things. Blue Nightshade. Makes you more stealthy. Okay. We have to just keep following where this flower pops up. And when we find the white one, if we grab that... Mm-hmm. It's poop. You found me. Have some feces. Thanks. Um, where did our horse friend go? I don't know if the whistle is going to work because we haven't technically made the horse hours yet. Yeah. Normally the whistle will bring the horse to you. But it's not technically ours yet, so... What's that? Iron, Iron Shroom. And this is, I think, supposed to be a Pona, so it's not just a random horse. Okay, we want to continue going this way. Also, if we soothe it, they'll become more friendly with us quicker. More quickly. Um, we want to be on the other side of this river if we can. Oh, also this is super easy to do. Is it metal? It's not. Okay. If we push this into the hole... Guess what? It's poop! <laughs> you found me! Ya ha ha! Like I said, I don't plan on getting all of these. Oh! Well, Flink attacked the animal and got some food. Does he actually eat it? He does, and he got health from it. Cool. Nice. Um, I would like to be on the other side of this river. I think I might have to go back to the bridge to do that. Keep going. Because I want to get to that tower. And horses cannot swim. And could die in the water. You know what? You stay here. We'll come back for you, I promise. Also, Wolfling is on the map, I just noticed. Amber. Okay, you stay there. I'm going to put a mark on the map right where you are. We'll come back for you. Swimming in rivers is not smart in real life. Well, that makes this a little bit more dangerous. I was like, who sees me from where? Come on, Wolf Link, let's run. They're definitely going to hear me whistling. Uh, let's go from up here to the left and jump down, I think. Probably is the best idea. Just keep on running. Keep on running. Keep on running. Oh, I was going to try to grab a stick. Just kind of ignore everyone. I didn't mean to do that. Thank you. Oh, this might be dangerous. Let's find out. It'll be fine. Dueling Peaks Tower. 
And if Wolfling can't like physically get to us, eventually he'll uh, teleport. I think. I don't know. I don't see him. Maybe he's back there somewhere. Oh, I'm running into a thing because I'm dumb. I'm not paying attention. Oh yeah, I see Wolfling over there. He's standing there. And he is taking damage. Okay. Uh, maybe don't do that. He's literally just... Rodden, you idiot! Mm. I just need to finish this before he dies. Which should hopefully be achievable. Also, I don't think... Oh, he teleported somewhere else? No? He's still there? Yeah. He doesn't get hit unless I'm watching him. I don't think so. He only, he's only down one heart right now, so it's fine. It should be fine. See some Octorok balloon things over there? That maybe we can jump to? But else we need to go back for our opponent. After we get this. Ah, there we go. Downloading patch. Nintendo took a uh, a note from Ubisoft when making this game. Climb towers, get map. Scanning area. I'm pretty sure if you translate the highly in text there, it comes. It uh, translates to like now loading or something. Yeah, that map that we saw earlier, that was just a tiny piece of uh, the game. That was like, what, 1 13th, I think? You also get this thing, the Sheikah sensor. It'll tell you when there's uh, shrines, that's the word, near. Spoilers, there's some near us. There's a couple I'm not going to be able to get to right away. You can turn this off if you want to. I'm probably going to keep it on as much as I can. I do want to grab these since <clears throat> I just got redo that, get a better jump and a running start. <clears throat> it's a fine. Probably. Probably fine. Yeah. <laughs> Game's like, what? Well, what was that for? Don't worry about it. That's better. Yeah, there is a shrine near here, I know. Bye bye. Oh, I didn't know what his bow was. Um. Yeah. Reminds me of another thing in Tears of the Kingdom that is super helpful for flying. Thank you. Um, oh, that's not really useful to me anymore. Mm. It's on the left, which means we still have to come back for our horse. I should, we should get the horse now, though. Um, oh, we'll blink despawned because the hearts are gone. But because they didn't die, we should be able to bring them back. Please? 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 I'm just gonna leave the... the card there. There we go. Where did that other flower go? There it is. Mm-hmm. Figured that. He got into water and despawned. Who's shooting things at me? Maybe a little bit higher. Still higher. Oh, nice. Got him. Didn't expect I would, honestly. I don't think Wolf Link can swim, so... 
Also, I think I'm going to run out of salmon if I do it this way. Um, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's not fine. Um, don't I have things that give me more stamina? Yeah, I do. Okay. Probably should use those. Yeah, just do this this way, I think. Also, I could have made it if I wasn't dumb. And I can get these, uh, Octorok tentacles. Nice. And my arrows back, or at least one of them. An Octo Balloon. Hey, look, it's a poop. Okay, I'm gonna teleport uh, up there again. And then I'm gonna go back to the horse from there. But the shrine that's near us is also on the left side. So we're gonna have to cross the river again, but we'll still have our horse closer with us. So we won't want to go back too far. Probably gonna have to summon a wolfling again when I get back on the ground. Yeah, because he's gone again. I'm on my way, Epona. I'll be there eventually. No, we cannot go faster. I think there is a thing you can make to make you go faster, but I don't have it right now, so shut up. Well, flank. Come here, friend. Thank you. Come on, friend. Let's go. We'll get at least closer to the, uh, the shrine. There's actually two way up there, but I don't think I have the stamina to get all the way up there yet, so we're not going to worry about them. Try nearby. Try nearby. Try nearby. You can turn this off, like I said. And usually I do, but I, uh, I, I actually didn't do all the um, shrines the first time I played this game. So, I would like to in this one. In this playthrough. You know, on the harder difficulty, because that's fun. Um. Oh yeah, I forgot. You have to love your horse for it to listen to you. I tried turning, but it, she said no. Let's put you over here for now. We should be able to get over there, I think. I have stuff if I need to. If I need to up my stamina. Nice. Those things in the water are kind of scary, and I don't want to deal with them right now. Oh, hey, there's just this stuff. Hi, Flint. Hi, Cole. Flint Cole. And an opal. Read a he. Read a he shrine. Bye, Wolf Link. See you later. I probably don't need to summon him right now. Probably when I do more fighting. Or more just regular exploring, besides, like, knowing where I'm going. We will slowly make progress in this game, I swear. Timing is critical. That was almost perfect. Where do I need to stand? Oh, it's coming to me. I was like, I don't, I don't know where I need to stand, man. No. Oh. I like how he kind of freaks out. Okay, and then this one. We have to actually slow it down before it goes down. There we go. Easy. I'm ready this time. Yeah, he's still kind of jostled. And there's, a, there's a chest over there. Let's do this first, though. Mm, was that good enough? Nope. Do it again. There we go. Mm, yep, yeah, okay. Actually, wait. Ah! Okay, um... I think the way they created this game was that there's multiple solutions to every puzzle. So, my solution might not be your solution. And if you have a problem with my solution, you can get the hell over it. Oh, 
was close. If a solution works, then it works. Also, pet gear. You know, we climb slightly faster. Um, is there a way up from down there? Is there a ladder? Yeah, okay. I want to see if there's anything in these barrels. These metal barrels. No. No, there's not. <laughs> so yeah, very slowly, but very, very slightly, I should say. Um, we climb faster. It's better than nothing. Skip it, skip, skip, skip. Up to two again. Cool. May the goddess smile upon you. Thanks, dude, and you. You, you too, dude. Bro, man, homie. Yeah. Okay, I think we are almost where we need to be to keep our horsey friend. We're good. Let's go collect them once again. Uh, there they are. Let's not deal with those guys if I don't have to. That'd be awesome if I didn't have to. Cool. I like how they're still just hanging out over here. Come on, friend. Let's go. I don't think there's any more shrines until we get closer to where we need to be. We should be able to... Yeah, there's that. That's where we want to go. And I think right near it is another shrine. Is there a chest? A stone chest. Okay. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Good horsey. Um, I was aiming for the head, but I didn't get it. I want your guts. Thank you. I want. I would. Ah, oh, man. At least a, a light. At least figure out what these are. Thunder arrows. Knock it off. How did that miss you? Really, dude. What? I think I hit the rock there. Damn it, Dwayne. There we go. Where's that chest? Not too worried about their guts right now. Thank you. Eh, not really worth it. Thanks, though. And I think there's something at the top of this, too. Please, please. Please. There we go. Yep, I know. Game. It's right over there. Mm-hmm. Yep. Is there anything good up here? I think there might be. I don't remember, though. There's a box. And, and a sword. A rusty broadsword. Um, let's actually push this. I'm trying to get to the other side. There we go. This way. Whee! Oh. I, bar I barely pulled that fast enough. Or soon enough. All right. I thought there might have been money in there, but I guess not. Hi, friend. Come on, let's go get you reg registered. There's a shrine nearby. I wonder where. I don't know where. Where's the shrine? Good horsey. This is a stable. Please, stop. You want to talk to the dude in... Please, go forward. There we go. In the little thing. I can give you directions. I don't care. Hey. Welcome to my stable. We deal in all hor things horse-related. We also double as an inn. Huh. I haven't seen your face before. Do you know about the stable system? I, um, I meant to... Yes. Well, allow me to explain. You can board your horse companions with us and summon them as you please from our network of stables. 
may come across wild horses during your travels. If you catch one and ride it here to register, it will become your horse companion. One person can board up to five horses, and you're able to swap between horses in and out as you please. You want to catch wild horses? Yep. Yeah. Oh, pardon me. Let me start over. Welcome to our stable. If you come with a wild horse, you can register right here with us. Or if you want to stay for a rest, please head to the end time counter. Uh, I'd like to register the horse I'm on. Gotcha. Uh, you sure this is the one? Yeah. Have you seen it? its stats? Also, our bond is already maxed. Nice. Not a problem. We charge a registration fee to help support our con... con ver conservation efforts. We also gets you locally made to saddle and bridle for your horse. That fee is one of the group. Is that okay? Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Please enter a name for your horse. Wait a minute. Isn't that the opponent of the horse of a legend? What are you thinking? You can't rename a horse legend? Pretty sure that's the law. There's a law against that. So opponent it is? Yeah. Registration complete. Would you like to take your new horse with you? Yeah. Thank you. See you next time. Oh, and by the way, you get separated from your horse. You can whistle when you have to come running. But your horse has a magic. You can't hear you too far away. So keep that in mind. I like how we just magically got a bridle. And a saddle. Um, this is Beetle. You're going to buy a lot of things from him in the game. I ate one of those apples. It was nice and crisp. Don't you hate it when you bite it into a soft apple? I don't think I've ever been to a soft apple. Pitchfork? Okay, we don't. We already have one of those discovered. Wood. Free wood that I clearly don't need anymore. Come on over. Hey, I don't believe I made your acquaintance. Name's Beetle, but you can call me... Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. Maybe if you forget my face, you can remember me by my beetle-shaped backpack. Despite these dangerous times, you'll find me traveling all over Hyrule to fulfill your shopping needs. I stock many special bugs and must-have items for travelers, and I always charge a fair price, or my name's not Beetle. I also buy all sorts of things. If you're in need of rupees, gemstones in particular, fetch a high price. How can I help you today? I'm trying to have something you'll find useful. Please have a good look. I hope. Always a good idea to buy arrows as often as you can. That's all my monies. Do you need anything else? What would you like to sell? I'm gonna give you all my gems right now because I don't need them for now. Four hundred tiny, tiny twenty. Amber, you can have all, all those for now. I, I am going to need some of these for later, but uh, we're not gonna worry about that now. I would like money now. You can also cl sell clothing. Um, eventually, I probably will sell, sell some of this lower end stuff because they're not super useful. And also, you cannot have every item of clothing in the game at one time. It's not a thing. Trust me, I've tried. Um, nothing else that I really want to sell right now. Hope to see you again. I think if you talk to him again with certain bugs, he might try to buy them off of you. Hey, welcome! Wow. Oh, you have you appear to have a bladed rhino beetle. Beetle loves bladed rhino beetles. Would you consider giving it to me? You get something in return, of course. Happy to trade it for meat and rice bowl. Sure. Nice. Low level attack boost. <laughs> Yahoo, beetle! So excited! You're such a sweetheart. I'll add this bad boy to my beetle collection. Yay! Anyway, back to business. I, I might be able to keep talking to him, but I'm good for now. Um, I got the scoop on Misko's treasure, and it's great. Listen up, Dak. Preston, hang on. Hey, buddy, what's your problem? You aren't being incredibly rude and listening in on our conversation, are you? We're treasure hunters on the trail of our latest score, the treasure of the great bandit Misko. It's as good as ours. Preston, you're going to give it all away. Sorry, Dak, I got carried away. Anyway, we're busy. We're busy here, dude. You need something? Take it up with someone else. Hmm. You again? Pay no mind to the little bros chatter there from before. He's got a penchant for running his mouth with crazy talk. So the treasure. Yeah, shoot. Well, can't say I didn't try to throw him off. Dak, why don't we just tell him? Maybe he'll leave us alone if we do. I mean, if we can't figure this riddle out, there's no way someone like him can be able to. That's a good point. We're after nothing less than treasure of the treasure of Misko, the great bandit. Funny would mean incredible riches. I'm not about to give this information away for free. I'm no fool. 
That's the keen sense of the strongest treasure hunter at work. No gold left behind. Not my Domadak. Domadak? You're great, Dak. It'll be 100 rupees to learn what we know. Mm, now I'm good. Not that we were talking about such a thing. It's only for the best of treasure hunters. That probably rules you up, but fewer people after it, the better. We've got the scoop. So you can pay them. And have them tell you. But I also know where it is, so I'm going to go to it after I do this. Mm, oh, yeah. Everyone forgets Cryonis. I was like, how am I supposed to get over this? Like that. <laughs> Some hardcore parkour. I was, I was going to say we could burn it, but also that we can't. Also, did I ever do that thing? No, I didn't. I no, I didn't do it in the first place. Well, that's dumb. Um, are you sure? Yeah, that. Um, damn it. There we go. I never updated that in the first place. Oh well. Anyway, there's this treasure chest up there, I think. Oh yeah, you can also do these on the side of walls, or I guess waterfalls. Wall, wall, Walter Falls, Walter, wall, water falls. But remember, you can only have three at a time. And don't let them touch, because then the, the new one will break the old one. See, that last one broke, so you can only have three. I don't think I need to make another one to grab this. Nice. Purple rupee. Whoa. Is that the only one? That's the only one. Cool. Now we just have to do the actual puzzle. I mean, I guess there was partially part of a puzzle to get over here. Boop. Oh, man. I think that's what we want. Mm. That's probably not going to do what I want. Oh, it did. Good enough. Yeah, sure. That works. Open sesame. <laughs> I just decided to jump. Pretty sure you can do like a... I don't know how to do it. Can you do it before the game teaches you? No. There you go. Yeah, you can defl do uh, deflects like that. It's kind of like a parry thing. Hi there. I would like to show you my tablet, and I would like to get your ball in my body. Not like that. Um, just give me the shiny light thing. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Bye. And the goddess is shine upon you too. I don't, I don't know, dude. Okay, let's go find uh, Misko's treasure. I don't think we need to pay those guys at all. Because that would be dumb. Also, it might lead us to another shrine. And also, those things are gone. So now we don't have any issue getting over here. I'm going to whistle and actually use the feature. Instead of using it to sprint everywhere. Oh, I missed. Okay, uh, we want to follow this bridge to the left. This way. Ah! You okay, girl? You're okay. Why'd you do that? That was silly. I see more Octorox. Octo balloons. Do they have anything? They have a, a metal chest. It's fine. I think we just want to keep going this way. Yeah. I think we want to go all the way to the end of the river, though. So, bye, Epona. See you later.
I'm not sure if you pay those guys if they tell you exactly where it is. I think they just tell you to go down the river. It's like way over there. And somewhere along the side is a like a secrety secret, a double double secrety secret, something like that. Could be friends around, so I don't really want to get too close. There's the double secret. Um, let's just use, do this, make it a little bit easier. And there it is. There's our, our next shrine. Potosa. Let's go in here and do this, and then we'll go grab the treasure, go turn in that quest. I don't think, even think it activated the quest completely. And then, um, figure it out from there. Oh, it's one of these. Great. These use motion controls of your controller. So you just have to wiggle your controller until you figure out where you want this to be. A shield of a shield that I already have. Well, technically the shield's used because I've been stepping on it. So I can just get rid of it. Because this is, this is the exact same thing, but not used. Best gamer ever. <laughs> Tried going around the chest and Link was like, I'm gone. I'm jumping. I'm going off. But wait, there's more. I don't think there's a chest on any of these, though. So we want to slide it, kind of. So these line up. And then turn. And right about there. Um, there is at least one more chest here. Surprised that's not, like, slowly moving over. But that was good enough. Is this the other one that everyone knows about? I think so. Oh no, this is a different one. This was not the one that I was thinking of. Okay. Um, there's the chest, so we want to... I'm physically just, like, holding my controller the way that I think it should go. Um, up. Uh, that should be good enough to get the chest. I think. Right about there. Yeah, yeah. Good enough. Small key! Oh, we needed that one. But that still counted towards the completion for it. Weird. Okay. And then it goes back to default. Um. Yeah, do that all the way. Then a little bit more turned, and that should be good, I think. Just need to hit the X button without moving the controller too much. There we go. That should be good. There's not a lot of these motion controls ones, but, you know, motion controls are not fun. Sometimes they are. Stuff for this, not really. Hi, I did it. I win. Give me my prize. Give me your ball. Your singular ball. Please and thank you. Your resourcefulness of turning your controller around has proven you were there. Yay! I'm surprised we got four of these done in one little session. That will definitely change in the future. But also, we're still early on in the game, so... Can't be too bad. Uh, we still don't have the treasure, though. I was going to teleport back, but not yet. Um, should be fine. Yeah. Get our stamina back and go up. Okay. Still need to find that actual treasure. It's way up there. We should have enough stamina to get there, I think. What are you? A silent room. Thanks. Also, I have the stamina refills, so it doesn't really matter. 
Free shroom. Yeah, it's up there. I'm pretty sure this rock here is a, a core rock too. Probably should grab that now or else I'm gonna to forget. Thank you. Yahaha, ha, ha, here's some poop. Bye bye. Eh. Okay, let's grab this. Stamina is at full, actually. I think this is easy as possible. And let's go. Hopefully we have enough. We should have enough stamina to get up to where we need. And also there looks like there's a couple places we can stand to regain more stamina. Standima? Does that work? Kind of. I was like, can I just put a block there? No, no I cannot. But I think this is as far as we need to go. Is here, right? Right? Yeah, okay, I can see the explosive, or explodable rocks. Thank you. Um, here, magic wall, I brought you a present. But wait, there's more. Okay, what is inside of these? Luminous stone, not too great, not too important. That will be important later on at some point. A sapphire, can sell that. Also going to need that at some point. A fire blade, that is 24. Um. Hmm. That does 20, these do 20, that's just 15, that does 20. Uh, we have this, so we technically don't need the sledgehammer. That, yeah, that definitely went a lot farther than I thought. Nice. It's literally a fire sword. Another sapphire, nice. Oh, there's two more chests. I didn't even see that one on the right there. Hammer. Toasted hearty truffles. Nice. And an opal. And also a spear that I don't care about. I think if you... Nope. I thought if you got really close... Well, that one's gone forever. <laughs> Open sesame! There we go. Single bird drumstick. That thing might have opened at some point. And the contents fall into the river. Oh yeah. I think. Nope. The bear, is it still alive? Oh no. It just opened. Cool. Mmm, fish. Free fish. Okay. Uh, let's fast travel back, not there, to this one. Hadamar. Oh, that was weird. That was like, the game didn't accept it at first, but it did. Go talk to those guys again and be like, hey, we got the treasure. It was just a bunch of gems and this cool fire sword. Let me stab you with it. Maybe they'll say yes. You never know. You gotta, we always gotta ask. You never know unless you ask. Eh. 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 Nah, this is the life. Sage, sir? Good evening. Don't see a whole lot of travelers passing through here. You know, with how peaceful it is around here, it's sometimes easy to forget that the world almost ended years ago. There's still monsters wandering around the area near Haru Castle. It's especially dangerous. If you're going to be traveling, you should know a thing or two about elixirs. Elixirs? You can make elixirs by mixing bug parts and other small creatures with monster parts. Most of them are no good for refilling your health, but they have a lot of other unique effects. Some elixirs can increase your speed, others raise your resistance to extreme temperatures. 
I'm actually impressed you made it this far without any knowledge of elixirs. I can't have it on my conscience if something happens to you from here, so I'll give you one of mine. Nice, that makes us fast. Using a hasty elixir increases your run speed, so I use it to escape from enemies or, or any time I need to hurry. The recipe is just a high-tail lizard and monster parts. So I usually have a stock of 10 or so on hand. Cool. Also, I just remembered right now. Um, I did do a few things. Um, I tore down a bunch of trees. When I got all that wood. And I also got a, uh, a core off, off screen. This one that I, I was talking about. Um, a lot. After it blows you up for nothing. Oops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to go faster. Um, let's say we're going to trim it, even though we're not going to. Yeah, you go up to the place where you woke up, and you interact with it, and you get a piece of poop. That's it. Okay, let's go talk to these bros and tell them how cool we are. You again? Pay no mind to my little bros chatter from before. Hmm. I already have the treasure. Hmm, I already have the treasure, though. Fine. I'll get more money. <laughs> good deal. Way to go, Dak, you did it. The twin, the little twin steps over the little river. My cave rests above the river's source. Let's go hit the location of the treasure in some kind of strange secret code. I heard this from a former dog walker of one of Misko's underlings, descendants, neighbors. As solid as, as a lead as any. Mm-hmm, sure. Just knowing someone with good intel like that, exactly what I expect from you, Dak. But I did it. But I did it. I already solved it. <laughs> You're lying. Pff, yeah, definitely lying. There's just no way a rookie like you could solve a puzzle like that before Dak. Not a chance. Dill's gotta be a Dak. Quiet prison. I'm trying to think. I just need a little bit more time to solve this. Okay, losers. Bye-bye. And I think that is a good time to take a break. <laughs>